Hi, in the last video, we have connected a Wi-Fi camera to this HDMI TV by using this HDMI receiver. This is the HDMI receiver and the output to the HDMI TV and this is the antenna. So it's going to receive the live video from the Wi-Fi camera. Now let's move outside and see how the camera set up. Here we got the camera. It's being installed into the bird house and it's just getting the power from the AC outlet. Now, the question now we want to do is we want a second Wi-Fi camera to the HDMI TV. So inventory, we can watch two cameras on the same TV. Is it working? Okay, now let's just move inside again to find out whether, how to get this job done. Here we got the second Wi-Fi Burbox camera. It's the same as the first one. Also, we have the antenna, this is power supply. Now let's just get the power. And we connect to the camera. It's going to take a while before the camera boots up. Before we can get this job work, we need to reset the camera, like just what we did on the first video. We reset the camera and we're going to prepare the camera, we make the camera ready. Okay, I need to depress the reset button and hold about 15 seconds. Then release. Then the camera will reboot and just be ready. Okay, meanwhile, let me just move to the mouse, use this mouse. You can see we got totally four channels. Actually, we can, technically we can add four camera, but I'm not going to advise you to do this. Why? Because the bandwidth will be not good enough. So I think the four, two camera will be good enough. Let's just move to the second channel. I think we can add to the second channel. And from here, we click the coding. Now, it, the, cam the HDMI receiver will try to find this camera and make the connection. It could take one or two minutes. It will, leave, it will take a little bit long, but depend on. And let's like what we mentioned. After we connect this camera to the HDMI receiver, you are not going to use this micro this micro this micro sticker slot. I mean, even you can install micro sticker, but there's no way you can read the file by using the HDMI receiver. I think we are getting the second camera. Yes, the camera is live now. Okay, let me just click exit. Okay, this is the second camera. Right, this is the second camera, and we also have the first camera. Now we got two cameras with the sense HDMI TV. How to watch these two cameras? You can use the mouse or you can just watch on the big screen by watching it at the same time. And is there any way you can use the remote control to switch these two? I think negative. You cannot use, you cannot use any remote control. But there's one feature it's called, I think that's called rotating. I mean, you can set to automatically switch in between these two but it's just up to you. Sometimes I think the mouse is really good enough. Now you can switch, just click the mouse to watch these two cameras. And now it's ready to mount this camera to the second bird house. So you can got two cameras in two different bird house on the same big screen by using the single HDMI receiver. All right, that's all for today's video. If you have any question, please post it in the comment section below. See you next time.